In this video, you will learn how to create an event and learn about the features available to you. Keep in mind, to create and manage an event, the organizer must have content admin access from the company page. How to set up access can be found on LinkedIn's Help Center. There can only be one designated organizer, and the organizer cannot be changed once the event has been created. Using this test account, I'll show you how to create an event. There are actually two different areas that you can do this from. One is using your admins tool dropdown, and the other is using your manage events tab. When you get to your create event page, you'll see that there's some information that needs to be filled out. Things like your event name, date and time, and a description about your event can be filled here. You can also showcase the speakers that will be speaking at your event. For those looking to collect and download attendee information, you can opt in to use LinkedIn's reg registration form. This is an example of what a registration form looks like. As you can see, there are six fields that can capture email, first name, last name, job title, company name, and company region. As of right now, customizable forms are not currently available but this is on our product roadmap for the near future. Next is location. So you do have the option of making this an online event or an in-person event. For online events, you can include a broadcast link. This is where you'd be able to paste the link of any type of webinar or live stream. So for example, if you're using YouTube live link or webinar, you can copy and paste it in here. If you don't have this at the moment, no worries. You can always update this field at any time, even after the event has been created. Click on the Create button and you're ready to go. You'll also see that you have the option of posting this event to your company page, and you can also use hashtags, which is highly recommended to include in your post.